Today I'm going to talk a little bit about automated external defibrillators. An AED is a device that when used can shock a patient back from an abnormal and dangerous rhythm to a normal rhythm. AEDs are known to save lives and it's important for you as a lay rescuer to understand how to use them. They are quite easy. When you come upon a victim, if the victim is unconscious, you ask someone to call 911 and obtain an AED. The most important thing is to turn the automated external defibrillator on and it will prompt you what to do. Unit OK. Stay calm. Check responsiveness. Call for help. Attach defib pads to patient's bare chest. Defibrillator pads show you where they should be placed. Attach defib pads to patient's bare chest. Just follow the diagram on the pad. Attach defib pads to patient's bare chest. Don't touch patient. Analyzing. The device will do its job. Don't touch patient. Analyzing. If the patient is in an abnormal rhythm, it will recommend a shock. Shock advised. Don't touch patient. Press flashing shock button. Ensure that no one is touching the patient. Shock delivered. Start CPR. The AD then instructs you on how to perform hands-only CPR. Continue the process until EMT or other folks arrive to help you out. There are attenuated pads for infants and young people under 50 pounds. They're a bit smaller and they give less, less energy, but the recommendation is that if you only have adult pads, even on an infant, you should use them to save that patient's life. AEDs are often found where you spend most of your time. They're in schools, buildings, shopping centers, and even arenas and airports. When you enter a building, look around. Just like looking for a fire extinguisher, look for the closest AED.